We don't do that. Hi, everybody. I'm Krellin, and with me, as always, is etc. A new dark cloud thing. We're thoroughly unprofessional. Hi, everybody. I'm Krellin, and joining me is New Dark Cloud. Also, I'm Andre. I recognize the smell of your blood, young canine. And I'm Malkavian. And he's etc. I could smell it even over the flood of my. No, I'm Krellin. Your cloud. I guess that works too. Puppets. The strength. And we're fighting this guy. Saved you from yourself. Or correction, Wretch we're about to fight this guy. Again. The blood is as soon as this guy finishes you. with his speech, yeah, this will be so, the this will be like the third time after that one time in the library. Miserable. Where he uses his blood shield and then attacks you with a broadsword. That never happened. Oh, I'm sure it happened. I remember it happening in my playthrough. You dreamed it. <laughs> you know, we might still be able to do that. I still, have the, I still have the broadsword in my possession from that. We're not doing that. It didn't happen. How about you West, Krellin? Fuck West. The blood of all the pawns. It all must be purified. So if you had any questions about the Sabbat, Andre's not going to answer them very well because he speaks in riddles, but everything he's talking about is what the Sabbat is all about right here. Uh, they're a doomsday cult. Um, they believe in the antediluvians. The Camarilla officially does not. And... They're basically, they're, they're trying to build an army of vampires to be ready to fight the antediluvians when they wake up. So tell me about his Zulo shape. Uh, that's the, the Zulo shape. It's kind of the ultimate expression of uh, the Shimichi discipline of vicissitude. So yeah, I figured out what was up with Blood Strike. This is what was up with Blood Strike. So what is the discipline? Point that you did. Gong, Are you talking gong, about flesh crafting gong, or something gong. else? I don't uh, get yeah, back when I do that, though. Vicissitude is the flesh crafting discipline. Its official name is Vicissitude. So, yeah. Didn't I tell you Thom Turgeon was awesome, etc.? I got gong, Thor. Gong, except, gong, gong. in my version of the patch, <laughs> it's worse because there's a brief little animation where he waves his hand in front of his face when doing blood strikes so you have a few seconds where you could be able to conceivably cast blood strike but because the animation is still playing you can't well i can it, only assume that this is a glitch in my version of the patch because it just doesn't work the way it seems like it ought to it actually works that way in the vanilla really yeah you can do the gong 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 thing in vanilla yeah, yeah you can so cloud oh, well, tell me about the plat not in my patch though tell me about the guy that made the patch change Fuck Wes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we'll get into more detail about the dangers between Etc.'s version of the patch and my version of the exact same fucking patch later on. Indeed. So I guarantee you will have a chance to bitch about it. And if not, I'll just wait till the very end. Oh, by the way, did the, the patches library thing actually work in your patch revision? The library works in my patch, yes. Because it was pretty broken when I tried it. So, this is the most odd, oddly timed conversation, perhaps in the entire game, at least in my opinion. This is the bit they added because when they were focus testing the game, ha 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 ha, uh, they found some players didn't know what was going on yet, so they just had somebody show up and tell you. They didn't realize that the player Out of all was a rat the people, yet. The, it, it feels weird the for Ming Zhao. It's just... Is his true love. Precious, eh. rare, people scary. didn't figure it out by now? I mean, the um, only thing I didn't figure out was that Ming Zhao was the one who impersonated Nines. They didn't actually focus test this game. Uh, it was a joke. <laughs> Really, I mean, it's an Activision game, you know. How, how, I would how, believe how would this not focus focus test test is. We are in a position to help each other. Yes. Yeah. Is this this is just an oddly timed. 
Oh, this is a game where you can choose your ending conversation. That conversation is the conversation with the cab driver. I know, but this is where it kind of sets up the expectation where you can choose your ending, even if it doesn't out outright let you choose it now. Because this is where I thought we were supposed to, uh, supposed to choose who I was going to side with at this point in time. Yeah, her conversation does actually run along that line. Um, and, and this is her kind of trying to extend an olive branch, you know, so you know that she could be one of your choices. She's like, well, you know, we, we fought each other before, but I meant nothing, no disrespect, and we can be friends. I'm here telling you the truth now so that you know I'm on the up and up. And of course, she's lying through her teeth. But whatever. Well, she's a vampire. She's all telling you. Always... She's telling half truths right now. Vampires always lie, and tell the truth, whichever most benefits them. And if they tell the truth, we're not telling you the whole truth. Sometimes the whole truth really is the most beneficial part. Krellen, is your cat snorting into your mic again? No. That's probably the fan I was telling you guys about. Okay, because someone is noisy for some reason. Well, it stopped, I guess, so. Okay, so it was me and it was my fan, just like I was telling you guys. Oh, wow. Okay. I have my fan on right we now, oddly enough. A mutually beneficial Incidentally, why did she tell the Changs to just reveal who LaCroix had an alliance with? I mean... I don't think she told the Changs to do that. I think the Changs are just stupid. Ah... Uh, that's pretty stupid, though. I mean, they but they seem like dumb muscle brains. anyway, so who yeah, cares? Yeah, they were not hired for their brains. <laughs> well, as far as anyone is hired in vampire society. It still it still feels weird that Ming Zhao is the one telling you because she really, aside from the fact that this is a game where you can choose your ending, has no real reason to come to talk to you at all. Well, but she wants you to choose her ending. She, like everybody else in the city, has realized you are probably the most powerful supernatural creature in the city, and she wants you on her side until she's done with you. I don't know. I think I'd still put my bed in with those werewolves. LaCroix they're they're pretty beefy. Well, are werewolves, strictly speaking, in the city? It Griffith Park is totally in the city. It, it doesn't actually matter. Werewolves will never be a viable option because vampires are literally the embodiment of everything they fight against. Okay, but they, you know, still seem to... Let me, let me you know, correct what well. Krellen said because tell you what he meant to say. He, this our character is the most powerful supernatural creature that we could conceivably form an alliance with. Yes, That's what he meant to say. To that that I would that would make sense. No a vampire trying to LaCroix, side with a werewolf would be the equivalent the of me siding with the cannibals in a Fallout game. And yet, there actually is a clan of werewolves that does do that on occasion. Our with the other werewolves don't trust them very much. This would be like you siding with Ondale in Fallout. Seems to have superseded all other concerns. I don't and actually remember Fallout. Discussion. Fallout 3, I mean. It is obvious to me that he wishes to obtain it. Fallout 3. It's been a while. Dang it. The cannibals, the cannibal town. Why wouldn't you side with the cannibal town? They have tasty foodstuffs. Because I'm not a cannibal, you evil prick. Choose cannibalism. Hey, <laughs> we know a cannibal, and she's not that evil. She's just a little coarse. But she is... She is on the lower side of karma neutral. She was perfectly fine contact, plus she gave me that bladder thing that didn't work. Stupid game. You are no more to him than an entry on his ledger. Clearly I have stopped paying attention. Hear these words, Kindred. The so yeah, this conversation... It, it also seems like it goes on for far too long. For, for, 
that it, might just be that I've been going really slowly because I've been well, distracted yeah. by the conversation. It it can end very quickly. If you're rude to her, like she, you, you can be rude to her once, and she gives you a second chance. If you're rude to her again, she cuts off the conversation. She just tells you, "I have the key. You can't get it." Nanny, nanny, boo boo, and runs away. <laughs> why would I? Why would I want to be mean to look? To, to her, I mean, LaCroix I'd get, but she's just, you know... Because she's a Kuei Jin and, the, and literally the enemy of vampires? Yes, but literally, literally she's an interesting character. Vampires. If, if you had actually talked to her in Chinatown, she is very, very, very condescending rude. to you. No, yeah. she's never rude. She is never rude. She is condescending. Still not as bad. I as consider LaCroix. condescending rude, but okay, whatever. Yeah, I guess arrogant would be a good way to putting it. Then there, there's a reason why condescending and rude are different words. They do mean different things. Now they can belong in the same category of bad behavior, but they're not exactly the same thing. Wait, what does get your hands off that mean? I thought it meant I thought it was what he did when probably I was behind there his was bench, stuff but now I'm not. There's, there's probably an implied food stuff in front of him that's not, that's not actually in the in-game graphics. Makes sense. Do you believe what happened the other night? I couldn't come into work on account I bought a tamale from a street vendor and got to scoot something. Or maybe the button on the bottom of the thing. Well, whatever. <laughs> This may be the first time in the history of mankind somebody's life was saved by a bad tamale. Hmm. Yeah. That's when Lucky Battle of the Runs. Is it possible to save him again, or am I just going to end up killing him in a few hours? You, you don't... You, yeah, oh. you can... He doesn't actually fight you. You can walk just right past You're him. Oh, oh, no. In my, my game, it, it must have been a glitch then, the because... He started cowering and then shot at me, so I made so I blood boiled him. <laughs> I think he might shoot at you, but I mean, it's not like he can do any significant damage. It's not like any other cop can do significant damage in this place either. But I don't like them shooting at me anyway. That I I find that kind of mean. But yeah, so fun fact: Lacroix was not expecting us this time, which means that this was even more of a suicide mission than all of the other suicide missions he's given us. Lacroix may be almost out of suicide missions at this point. Well, I we haven't what yet chosen now. whether to save the Reaper or blow it up. So, we, obviously, we haven't finished suicide mission yet. Wrong game. Don't you want the proto-human reaper baby? The appropriate song for this particular moment would be Don't You Want Me Baby, but I don't want to sing that. The Sabbat. Another obstacle is removed. From the enemy, we resurrect a new order. I do love when they give you three options to say basically no the exact same thing. To your service. Did you hear that? I always you do the dead one. Completely. Like, Keep it I know, I know you, it, you don't. They don't need to, but it's a very nice little touch. My victories in this city are in no oh, just curious. Why does Lacroix insist on getting you killed here? Um, for the same reason he killed your sire, and for the same reason everybody wants you on your si on their side, because you are literally the most powerful creature in the city, and he Except wants you out of the way. Yes, hey, we're so, gonna, far, so far as we're he knows, going to you, kill he, the he werewolf. Can still I think we're more you. powerful than it. One werewolf. We kill yes. werewolves. Spoilers, dude. Just just the one. You found the key. Well, who has it? This nonsense again. And uh, Look, more to the point, um, no at this point, certainly, LaCroix is thinking of you as probably his biggest rival towards the prize he's working after as well. And apparently, it's worked. As of this moment, there is no blood... LaCroix accusing anyone of the subterfuge is... It's, there's the, there's so much irony there, it's ridiculous. Well, 
To that, I propose an alliance with the Anarchs. Yeah, it takes Together, one to know one. We kindred shall drive out these Suppose. foreigners once and for all. These foreigners. Yeah, because we're the Americans. Get rid of those foreigners. Says the French I was thinking vampire. More of, I was thinking French. more of foreigner the band, but whatever. Stupid French. It's not a matter of trust. It's a matter of who they dislike more. The Camarilla or the Kuei Jin? The Probably Kuei Jin still the Camarilla. The last leader and threaten all of our kind. Well, keep in mind, everyone, every vampire in existence hates the Kuei Jin. Yeah, but and on the other hand, they don't care too much about vampire politics. So They, they care a lot more about the Kuei Jin trying to kill them than any sort of grudge they, can't, they might have against the law. They haven't been going for the killing vampires thing recently, though. That's because the Camarilla showed up and there's too many vampires for them to safely kill the Anarchs without the Camarilla involving. And it's a whole political thing. The last round immediately. Tell them the Quay Jin have admitted Man, the politics Anarchs, sucks. The blood hunt against Nines Rodriguez is officially over. Tell them I have realized... I vote we go wild card. Pose and wish to yeah, you voted that you will be my a lot of times already. So naturally, so. And every single one of them counts. The if we're not going to do the Ming Zhao ending, we're going to do the uh, Strauss ending. The prosperity of all this city's kindred depends on your success tonight. That's a good question. Should we do the Ming Zhao or the Strauss ending? Like, seriously. No. I'm doing the Ming Zhao ending exactly as much as I want to do the LaCroix ending. We should do the LaCroix ending, because no one does the LaCroix ending. And neither do I. <laughs> Damn it. Sheriff, get over here. I wonder if I can get LaCroix <laughs> out from the desk. I bet I can get LaCroix. If it was possible, Cedra would be a a half half breed of Tremere and Malkavian, if it was ever possible. What? Is it possible to be a Malkavian who thinks he is a Tremere who can actually do thaumaturgy? Like, is that something that you could do in the tabletop? Uh, so, yeah, in the tabletop, you are not restricted by clan on what disciplines you know. It's just easier for you to learn the disciplines of your clan. Um, it is virtually impossible for, for a non-Tremere to ever learn thaumaturgy, though, because somebody who knows it will have to teach it to you. And the Tremere don't do that. 